All right, here we're going to look at some examples related to subtraction of integers. And what we're going to do is we're just going to make some number lines to illustrate these subtraction equations. So in part A, we've got 2 minus 3 equals negative 1. Well, in terms of our number line, the first number we have is positive 2. So I'm going to go two units to the right. And then we're subtracting away positive 3 units. So you can think about, again, subtracting a positive as going to the left. So we'll go left one, two, three units. And again, if we, go, if we subtract three units, um, we'll end up at the value of negative one. So that could be our number line, two to the right, three to the left. Part B is a little tricky here, a little bit trickier, just because of uh, there's a lot of minus signs floating around. So the first thing I'm going to do is negative two. So that's going to move us two units to the left. So there's our two units to the left. Now, if we were subtracting away a positive 5, we would keep going to the left. But since we're subtracting a negative 5, what we're going to do is now move to the right. So let's see, we're at negative 2, and then we move one unit, two units, three units, four units, and five units. And again, you can count this would be 0, 1, 2, and this would put us at positive 3. So that would be a diagram that goes with, or a number line that goes with part B.